I'm Darcy Storms, and I'm in the one-year associate degree program for Accessories Design. Vasilios, Professor of Accessories Design. Sarah Mullins, Chairperson of Accessory Design. My name is Den Lee. Uh, my label brand name is Dennis Lee. And hi, my name is Nelly Ganan, and I'm a Fashion and Accessories Designer at the Fight Team. Ellen Goldstein Lynch, Professor of Accessories Design. Not a lot of schools that offer a footwear accessory program. Our students are really immersed in everything from design and construction. Um, they are literally learning how to sew and operate the equipment and machinery that it takes to make a handbag, to make a shoe, to make a belt, to make a hat. This is actually design construction and you get a little bit of a business taste. The successful designer is the one who really understands and knows construction. You know, maybe they're not the best sewer, maybe they're not the best pattern maker, but you know, you can look at it and you can actually tell uh, the people you're working with, you know, eventually, well, this is off for a reason. and This doesn't fit right, this doesn't hang right, or whatever it is. So this is why, again, you know, we are the number one school in the country. It's not only FIT, it's more where FIT is located, it's New York City, it's the connections that um, the school gives you. Here, we push to make sure that you are the best you could possibly be. It's amazing because in one, actually less than a year, only nine months, you walk away with a degree and this sort of lightning fast baptism of fashion fire into accessories and you walk away with making things you could actually wear on your body, which is incredible. The pros of this program is uh, I actually have friends who were in there and they were able to land work, so you definitely do get work. I think one of the biggest pros is the, um, the assortment of people in the program too. I think definitely all of the classes and techniques and all of the courses and things you learn here at FIT influence your style. Living in New York is like nothing else, so I'm really inspired by everything around me here. As far as in New York goes, I mean obviously um, FIT, you know, the, a great draw is being in the city and in New York and we're the only accessory degree program in New York and then our competitors who aren't here don't have access to the industry. I decided to transfer to New York because, um, because of the culture. I, was, I thought I was really young for Europe and decided to come to New York which was more my style and it definitely was a great decision. You know, a lot of people ask me, you know, so FIT doesn't have a campus. And I'm like, are you kidding? It's Manhattan. <laughs> New York City is not bad. It's like, if, if, if I got stuck here, I would be happy. There's so many pros. Uh, it's overwhelming right now. Uh, you, you get to make things, which is very unique compared to a lot of other programs in school. So there's nothing like, you, you might suffer. You're going to suffer. But when you're finished with it, you're so proud of it and you can walk away and wear it or you can give it to someone and they can wear it. And it's just, it's so prideful and incredible. Con is a lot of work. You're going to always be here. You probably won't have time for a part-time job. Are you ready to not sleep? <laughs> um, it's a lot of hard work. It's very intense. That, that's con, but that con is at the same time a pro because you're going to get better from that and it makes you, it divides you know, the separation of who will get hired. There's a lot of students that I, I'm a little older than them. I give them advice, they go and party, but if you're not here, it shows. Don't make shoes with lambskin. And <laughs> That's my one advice, take it seriously. Pay attention early on and be thinking about what your final collection might be or something that you really love and think about shaping it towards your creativity and what you're inspired by. You need the ability to create and design things that have never been done and you need to like translate that idea through your hands. I think also being professional no matter from the classroom, mm -hmm. you know, to your job site. High on the prize. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs>